what's good y'all it's me back again with another video if y'all saw my first video um please enjoy it it's me and my brother having a 1v1 but yeah as you can see here i got some warframe gameplay about to do this uh this story time but it's not about to be the regular story time but I'm about to, it's about to be like some real stuff you feel me uh the other one about the bb gun let me throw his real guns and homies doing that in philadelphia that's my first story time ever it was kind of messed up but this one like I really got to the altercation type stuff. So yeah. Um, I hope you enjoy story time. <laughs> I'm so sorry, like uh I, I can't really like express how I wanna say sorry, like no words can explain. But I do have I could I do have different uh a warframe, um what you call it, warframe clips 'cause as you if you don't know, when you get into the deep levels like this, people don't wanna stay. They would wanna like not stay. But yeah, I have different Warframe clips. I'm not sure how long this story is going to take. So if it's short, like 12 minutes or so, I might take like one or two, one clip and a half. Maybe it could be like 30 minutes. I'm not sure how long it's going to take me to do this. But I don't care. We're going to do what we got to do. You feel me? You feel me, baby? But yeah. Um. So yeah, man. We're just about to do this. Uh, And start off on... Um, our story time. So like our heavy intro. <sighs> What's good y'all see my camera in the video? Uh, please share my channel with your friends and family so we can make a better community on this channel. No only positivity, no negative vibes. And yeah man, we just gonna get into it. So this uh story time was about how me and my homies almost got jumped and then jumped them at, and then jumped the people that tried to jump us out the next day. And yeah, this all started off with basketball. <laughs> I know, basketball. <coughs> Sorry, I'm sick, guys. <clears throat> but like, if you don't know, basketball could get really competitive, especially in the damn hood, right? Cause it was about to, it was about it was around the summertime, right? And around this time, my grandfather normally take me out for like an hour and an hour and a half, or maybe two hours after school, just to chill outside. You don't have fun, cause right next to my school there was a big ass park, right? And yeah, that's where me and my homies would like play basketball. So, so it was after school. Both of my boys, as you know, I get picked up with my grandfather, but they, they go home by themselves, and their parents don't really care. They got phones and everything. They tell them to go be playing basketball late, you know, and they live close by me, so sometimes they'll just walk with my grandfather as well, and they're like, they'll just go on their way. So their, their parents, like, didn't care as long as they get too dark, you know. In the summertime, it starts getting dark around 7, like, <laughs> my school closed at 2, two, uh, two o'clock, so yeah. I mean, 220, sorry. So, yeah, as you can see, um, we I went in the basketball court. And if you don't know basketball, <clears throat> if you don't know basketball, it don't matter, like, where you go. Like, unless it's grown men, anyone will let you play. Like, just say, yo, can I play with y'all? Yeah. Then they just go, like, don't say, don't ever say, please, like, can I play with y'all, please? No, they'll say, like, can I join the game? And that's what we did. Like, we walked up. We are third graders at the time. Um, I can't, I don't want to say these guys' names just in case, you know, dudes be tripping. In this case, like, they subscribe to me. So, one of my boys, the names was, uh, I'm, I'm going to make up some names. One was Pete, and one was Trey, right? Pete was a big, nice, thunder looking dude. Trey had a jump shot, and I had handles in the layup, right? We were, like, the perfect team. There was some fifth graders on the court that, I know, we don't really talk to them, but I see them, like, in school sometimes. And one of them... I'm gonna call them. I'm gonna call that person Tyshawn, right? I'm gonna call that person Michael. Michael is more of a trouble name, and Michael he got into trouble, so I see him in the office a lot. Cause the thing is, I got into trouble. <laughs> That's why I'm so known in that school, right? So what happened was, we played basketball, and it was crazy how these guys look tough as hell, but like we won the first game, right? Cause I'm short. I ha I really have like a lot of hops. Like I got springs on my feet, yo. So I was getting boys playing it back up, shooting. My boy uh Pete was laying up, Trey was, you know, doing his thing, you know, so the screens of things. Like it was a good game. The second game the first game Michael didn't play. There was four of them, right? The first game Michael didn't play, he was tired because he, he was playing like 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 an hour before, like I, I, I don't know. Cause it's not fresh out of school. So it's like one hour after we all eat ices and stuff, like and play in the park. So cause that's now we're at the basketball court. So yeah, like he's tired. I think he was playing 21. Cause like there was four of them just going out. I think he was playing 21 before. 
And yeah, the second game, Pete joins. He sees I got some skill. And he sees that his team lost. He's like, nah, I'm going to redeem my team. And this guy's good. Like, I watched him for like 10 minutes straight. Like, homie was crazy with it. Like, you know, <laughs> like he was nice with it. Like, he's, I think he was on the ball team. I'm not sure. But, um, yeah, he was really nice with it. And um, what else? And I'm trying to think. All right. Oh, yeah, here it goes. <clears throat> Let's continue. So he played the second round, and, like, I didn't believe it. We actually won, right? And one thing I didn't believe, because he was so nice. Like, we only won by, like, two points. But he, I didn't know. One thing I didn't know, that he was a sole loser. Some nice guys, you wouldn't think they would be so losers. But, I mean, we lose in the... Like, when you're on the ball team, like, one of the nicest, and you lose to some bummy uh, third graders, and you're, like, a senior, you know, kind of getting your feelings a little bit. I'm not even going to lie. Like, sometimes if I lose to my brother in a game or something, I'll get tight and be a sole loser. But, yeah, right? So, where was I? I was at the part where uh, they lost the second round, right? And now he's mad. He's like, oh, come on, 1v1, 1v1, 1v1. And we're like, nah, if you want to play horse, we're down. Like, I don't want to fucking one. And my boys, they went to go get ICs, right? I'm like, you know what? I'm going to 1v1 this guy, right? And then, yeah, man. I'm saying, like, how I'm going to 1v1 him. And I went to go finish. I went to my grandfather. I, went, I finished the rest of my IC. And when I come back, remember, this is third grade, y'all. Wasn't really too much of a tough guy, right? So it's third grade. Uh, went to get my IC with my grandfather. Came back to the court. I'm ready. My body nice, you know? Sweat coming down, I look like I'm putting in work, right? So come down, right? And he takes off his school shirt and he has a, a, a white beater under there. And he's playing in that. And I'm, you know, in my regular school clothes, my sweatpants, stuff like that. Because it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a Tuesday, Thursday right now. I had gym that day. And Friday, we don't care. School don't care what we wear. It's a Friday, right? But I normally say, wear the same thing on Friday just in case I can get the uniform credit. So, like, like I said, you know, I'm wearing a regular thing. He takes off his shirt, puts on his white tee, let's go. He says, shoot for ball. And this guy immediately, he, he goes to the three-pointer, poof, wet like water. So says, check up. Now, I think I'm in trouble, right? Because my boys are watching, and his boys are watching. I don't want to get uh, embarrassed in front of him and get crossed up. So, like, literally half of the time, like, when he was at the three-pointer line, I let him rock. When he come in the paint, I try to block him. And he wasn't shooting, like... His jump shot was nice. Like, his form was kind of ugly a little bit, but, like, he'll make it, like, almost every time, right? So, right now, it was like, uh, I was doing my thing, you know? Uh, I, and you, you might think I'm lying, but, like, I won. I kept my strategy. Let him mark right a three-pointer. Because if you didn't know, our rims were kind of trash. Like, <laughs> so, like, if you made it, you was nice, but you wasn't making it every time. Because our school room was mad bouncy, wasn't nice at all outside. Only the ones inside. And after, after school, we can't go inside because we don't have after school. So we have to play with the ones outside in the court, right? So, yeah, like I said, <clears throat> he missed a few shots. And I was with my stuff, you know, crossing it up, you know, doing my thing. And then this guy would have come in after I beat him. Like, like I kept my strategy. I was like, oh, what? I think it's a game. Huh? And then, like, he pushed me, and when he pushed me, I, I grabbed his arm, like, quick, and grabbed him. We started tussling and tussling, and no freaking yet or anything like that. And then his boys grabbed him, my boys grabbed him, and he's like, I'm going to see y'all tomorrow. And I'm like, I just might not come to the park tomorrow, because, like, <laughs> he tripping, like, it's a game of basketball. I didn't really understand. I mean, now, the days, I would probably fight a dude over some basketball, but back then, I didn't really care to be like I wasn't on no team, like like I, I didn't even play 2K like that, like <laughs> like I, I didn't really care. Like I was just good at the sport, <laughs> to be honest. That's like that's like being wavy at tennis but barely playing it. You feel me? But yeah, right. Like I said, it's the next day, and uh, my grandfather he drops me right the park. I'm on the monkey bars, and his homie actually walks up to me, and he's like, yo, bro, I'm sorry for yesterday. If you want to pull up, we can play, right? And yeah, me and him, we played a horse, a game of horse, and this kid walks out with his, uh, he walks out with the other homie. Michael walks out with his other homie, because remember those four of them? For some reason, there was only three this day. So yeah, Michael came in with his other homie, and, and me and 
Which one? Which one? Which one do I give the big one? Pete. Me and Pete are outside. So it was like a 3v2, right? And, I mean, not really, because we all did play as teams. So I see Michael coming, I'm like, oh. And I get, like, I get, like, next to Pete just in case, like, something happens. And Michael comes in, he's like, yo, 1v1. He literally grabs a uh, homie's ball and just throws it to me. Obviously, I catch it. I kind of chip my nail a little bit, but I ate that. Right? Because, like, you know, chip my nail. And I beat him. And after, you know, we start tussling, he slapped me. Kicked him in his knee, punched him in his face, started going in, and then when he tried to jump me, uh, my boy Pete, you know, who's a big dude, so he dropped, like, both of them, and me and Michael was, like, you know, having it out, going crazy and stuff like that, like, Pete was big body, like, when I tell you, homie would literally kill someone, I'm not lying, like, he was big body, like, nobody was touching homie, but yeah, like, that's kind of, like, my, uh, my story, and then the next day, I mean, yeah, it was a Friday, and then Monday, I guess the word got out, and the principal, you know, rang me upstairs when I was in class. I was at uh, ELA, actually, first period. And I was scared, cause I didn't know what was gonna happen to me. Then my mom about to get involved. And the principal, he was cool as hell. Rest in peace, he died like last year. Rest in peace, that was my real homie we right there. Rest in peace, you feel me? Rest in peace. Uh, and what, hap what that happened was he called me up uh, at I go to his office, and he was like, yo, and I see Michael there, I'm like, oh boy, here we go. And then he talks to us and he's like, yo, on the real bro, y'all fight over basketball. I so put to call y'all parents. I mean, his face is kind of slowed up. Like, I mean, my leg was still, my, uh, my, my fault. My arm was still hurting a little bit. His, like, cheek was a little bit swollen. He wasn't, like, too noticeable unless you stared at him and stuff like that. And, like, yeah, pretty much, like, yo, I'm gonna let you off the hook. They all got to shake like that, so we shook it off like that, and we all actually played, um, I forgot like what, I think we played Call of Duty on his Xbox, yeah, I think it was, it was some game, I think it was Call of Duty, yeah, definitely Call of Duty, we played on his Xbox for like one period and he let us back up, and like, you know, I didn't tell anyone, like, it's my first time, like, telling anyone, and yeah, man, that's my story time, you know, so I hope y'all, Enjoy this episode. I'm gonna end it all. I can end it always, yo. You feel me? Please share my channel with your friends and family. And so we can make a positive vibe on this channel. No negativity. You heard? <laughs> but yeah, yo. See y'all till next time. And I'm out.